Hello everyone and welcome to our virtual awards evening and our awards evening is in my opinion one of the most important events in our calendar. Whilst it's tinged with a little bit of sadness perhaps this year as we can't all be together, it is nevertheless really important that we celebrate the wonderful achievements of so many amazing young people at Featherstone High School. And can I begin by paying tribute to our public exam classes of 2020. Year 11 and Year 13, we're very, very proud of you. You've been through a roller coaster of emotions since COVID-19 so brutally arrived and snatched so much away from you. Your opportunity to show just how much progress you had made through your public examinations. Your proms, your leavers tees, your shirt signings, these are all rites of passage which you were sadly denied but you've shown great maturity in coming through that and um, superb role models for our, for our school values showing enormous resilience and in overcoming all those challenges that you were faced with so well done and perhaps a special tribute to to our sixth form graduates year 13 your roller coaster was particularly turbulent you were faced with those flawed algorithms, the government's flawed algorithms, which depressed your A-level grades initially by so much. Fortunately, good sense prevailed and you were awarded the teacher grades that you all thoroughly deserved. And they allowed you, of course, 95% of you to go off to a university of your choice. And that included some of the top Russell Group universities and congratulations to, to Fadi who's studying law at Oxford and of course the most competitive of fields this year we were very successful with four of you um, graduating in, into medical school and for the first time we won a £200,000 scholarship to, for a student to, to, to study in the United States at Denison University, Ohio. So congratulations to Arth Patel and thank you very much Arth for your message and it's good to see that you've already perfected a South All American accent after a matter of weeks in the USA. Hi, my name is Arth and I'm currently an international student studying in Ohio, USA at Denison University. I'm studying at one of the top private liberal arts colleges in the USA where I'm taking four classes this semester math physics theater and English literature and language after hours and hours spent on my application I received a full scholarship of approximately three hundred thousand dollars to study at this university for four years which covered up to four meals a day accommodation tuition fees and other expenses Staff at Featherstone were very helpful and at times spent day and night writing recommendations for me to get into this uni. After many rejections, I finally got into university and with very good money too. I'm very grateful to all the staff at Featherstone that put in all the hard work for me to receive such an amazing opportunity. And without the encouragement and motivation, there was absolutely no way I could be where I am right now. My high school experience was the best and I miss all my friends, families and teachers back home because being a Featherstone student my whole life, I created way too many amazing memories like performing in concerts and musicals and being in the charity committee and I will never forget those. I thank each and every one of those teachers that helped me to become the person I am today. Thank you. And of course the year was dominated by COVID-19 and the challenges and, and pressures that that put upon schools across the country. And I'm hugely grateful to uh, our staff who worked incredibly hard to overcome those challenges. We were setting online work at the t same time as, as running classes in school. We issued over 350 laptops to families to allow children to access their online learning and delivered them where, where that was needed. So thank you to, to all colleagues who, who worked exceptionally hard under those very challenging of circumstances. And perhaps I can finish by paying tribute and congratulating the most important people in this awards ceremony and that of course is the, the prize winners themselves. You thoroughly deserve those awards, you've worked exceptionally hard for them and we're all very, very proud of you. So once more, it's been an exceptionally strong year at Featherstone High School. So thank you all very much for your contribution to that year. Hello, as head of Year 9, I'm very pleased to make some awards to some well-deserving Year 9 students. 
First of all, some um, house awards. First of all, for um, the head of Honor House. Um, this is an award for Ayanch Talwar, who came first in our um, Year 8 in the House Lockdown Challenge with some amazing contributions. Well done to Ayanch. Uh, and coming second in the same competition was Arshpreet Bassi of Nine Parks. This is on behalf of the head of Equality House. Uh, Arshpreet helped her form to an overall first place as a form. Uh, so well done to you too. Also for a head of house, this is for the head of Inspire House, I'd like to make an award to Rabjot Marta of Nine Einstein. Uh, this is for showing great courage and resilience by performing a solo dance performance for FHS Got Talent and coming third overall. Well done, Rabjot. Uh, the following awards are for progress and achievement. So these come from um, me as head of Year 9 and these recognise students who have made more than usual or outstanding progress and achievement over the course of Year 8. So a very big well done goes to Alex Capita of Mandela, Gopri Kaur of Mandela, uh, Jashin Saini of Einstein and Fatma Ahmed of Mandela. Well done to all four of you. Absolutely fantastic. Thank you very much. Good evening, everyone. This is Mr. Mohammed, and I am the head of Year 10. It is always a pleasure to be able to speak at the awards evening and an honour to acknowledge the hard work of some of Featherstone High School's most talented and hardworking students. Our students have had to endure incredibly challenging circumstances in the past academic year, and it was absolutely wonderful to see the Year 10 cohort rise to the challenge and excel under such unprecedented circumstances. So it was very difficult to pick four students for an award tonight. However, I am certain that the year group would agree with me that the four students who are receiving an award tonight are fully deserving of it. Without much further ado, Students who will be receiving the Head of Year Award for Outstanding Progress and Achievement are Ria Mauji in Churchill, Sahil Nuri, also of Churchill, Alvin Brahoj of Shakespeare, Beth Curry of Einstein. I am very proud of each and every one of you. Well done. Welcome parents, guardians and Year 11 students to our virtual awards assembly. Let me start by saying how proud we are of all the students and feel they are all winners for the resilience they have shown over the past six months. The award winners today are a true representation of what we stand for here at Featherstone High. They are a credit to their teachers, their form tutors, their parents and to themselves. Congratulations to all of our winners today. Thank you. The Community Award goes to Abdallah Abdi 11 Gandhi for his excellent dedication to the Stepping Stones mentoring programme. Abdallah built such positive relationships with his mentees. He created activities and quizzes which have been used by all mentors to build rapport with younger students. Abdallah has planned a full aspirations and team building workshop for the previous year seven, but was unable to go ahead with this. We are hoping that he continues his great work with the new year seven. Congratulations, Abdallah. We are awarding two Head of House awards for Liberty Head of House. Ayush Ramniklau, 11 Roosevelt. Lapdip Kaur, 11 Roosevelt. Both for outstanding leadership and assistance for house events. Featherstone runs a successful house system and teachers rely on the help of students. Labdip and Ayush have been important members of Liberty House, leading and supporting house events and competitions. Congratulations, Ayush and Labdip. The Head of Year Achievement and Progress Award goes to Gaurav Daddy, 11 Parks for being an outstanding student with an exemplary approach to his education. This is recognised by all his teachers and peers. He demonstrates amazing public speaking and is willing to carry out assemblies in front of his year group without any hesitations. Gaurav takes pride in his education and always makes a fantastic effort and is greatly respected by his peers and his teachers. He is always willing to challenge himself and this award recognises these qualities. Well done, Gaurav. The Head of Year Progress and Achievement Award goes to 
Bassett Ferrugi, 11 Shakespeare. For showing resilience and determination throughout his time at FHS, Bassett has made significant academic achievements and is an inspiration for many other young people. With his enthusiasm for life and his heartwarming personality, Bassett has a great I can attitude to school life and this award acknowledges his continuous hard work. Well done, Bassett. The Head of Year Progress and Achievement Award goes to Maya Francis Parnell, 11 Parks. For proving what can be achieved with determination and hard work. You have done so tremendously well during your time at FHS, even when you have not believed in yourself. Maya, we are very proud of your achievements. You have shown willingness to partake and be actively involved in succeeding in your outside goals, such as receiving three art awards in the summer and progressing with your football teams. All of your hard work has paid off and your successes are quite rightly being publicly acknowledged and applauded through this award. Well done, Maya. The Head of Year Award for Progress and Achievement goes to Janita Bagvandas, 11 Churchill, for outstanding effort and achievement. Janita is an outstanding student who has proven that hard work and determination has a big impact on academic progress. Janita is a very pleasant and helpful student who goes above and beyond to make sure she is working to her full potential. We are so proud of Janita, who is an absolute asset to Year 11 and to Featherstone High School. Congratulations, Janita. Good evening, everyone. I hope you are well. I'm Miss Moses, Head of Year 12. I've had this year group since Year 7 and I'm very proud of the incredible achievement over the last five years. These students have shown commitment, resilience and determination. The first award I'd like to present this evening is for exceptional and outstanding GCSE results. This award goes to Hajat Sidhu with 10 grade nines, Aruthan Muhanthan, nine grade nines and one grade eight, Ramesh Chandlal, seven grade nines, three grade eights, Alam Bra Abra, nine grade nines. Summit Bassi, seven grade nines and four grade eights. Kalashdeep Singh, seven grade nines and four grade eights. Jaspreet Kaur, who has made an outstanding progress in all her GCSEs. Fathia Said, again outstanding progress in all her GCSEs. And then finally, Yuvraj Singh, with outstanding progress again in all his GCSEs. Now I'm going to present the awards for outstanding achievement in each subject. The awards are for English, Maths and Science. Side Side GCSE Maths, outstanding commitment to the subject. Kalashdeep Singh, Great effort and resilience shown throughout the year for English language. Walid Asif, GCSE English Literature. Great effort and resilience shown throughout the year. Hajat Sidhu, Physics. Highest attainment in GCSE Physics. Thanks to Hajat's dedication for studying the subject combined with learning to think like a physicist. Alan Bra, Combined Science, Highest Attainment in GCSE Combined Science. Alan has demonstrated most improvement and dedication to the subject. Hajat Sidhu, GCSE Biology, for her hard work and dedication to the subject and always been supportive towards other students. Aruthan Muhanthan, GCSE Chemistry, worked extremely hard and, did, and, and is a dedicated student. 
just recall computer science, outstanding effort and perseverance in all aspects of the subject. These awards are for humanities and modern foreign languages. We have Summit Bassi Geography for consistent hard work throughout the course and this has resulted in his exceptional progress. Mohamed Tifel, History, outstanding progress in history, passionate about the subject and for sustained effort throughout the academic year. Alambra Ari, Alam, through her dedication, resilient and drive, demonstrated outstanding improvement and progress in GCSE. Alam also wrote, rose to the challenge of sharing her strategies for succeeding in RE by delivering an assembly to year 11 students, which was met with great success. Isha Gahe Punjabi Outstanding effort and resilience in Punjabi. Anmol Preet Singh, Spanish. Outstanding effort and commitment in the subject after starting in year 10 at Featherston High School. Rohan Ahmed, French. Outstanding commitment and resilience in French. These awards are for expressive art. The first award goes to Snea Dekuna for her GCSE art. Sneha has shown dedication to the subject and has worked exceptionally hard. Alafia Osman, GCSE drama. Again, Alafia has worked consistently hard throughout her course. Alafia has a great attitude to learning in class and this has led to her producing fantastic performances. Mohamed Malki, BTEC Music First Award. Mohamed has shown outstanding commitment to music and has, achi and has achieved a distinction star. Aditya Suresh, GCSE Music for his outstanding contribution to the music department. Excellent level of professionalism and musicianship throughout his time at Featherston High School. The final awards are for sports, business, and health and social care. First award goes to Jay Jamant, GCSE PE, for his outstanding effort in both theory and practical elements of the subject, also for contributing to the highest grade achieved in the class and a full grade of four above his target grade. Isha Gahe, BTEC Award and Enterprise, BTEC Business and Enterprise for outstanding effort and commitment to the subject. Nikita Sharma, Health and Social Care. Dedication to studying Health and Social Care. Mahima Roka, BTEC Sports First Award. For outstanding effort in BTEC Sports, achieving merit in her coursework. And then finally, Alam Abra, GCSE Business hard work and dedication to business and her imagination and initiative. Hello everyone, my name is Miss Williams and I am Head of Year 13. It brings me great pleasure to be presenting the following awards to these Year 13 students in honour of their outstanding efforts and the great contribution that they have shown to the school community and beyond. The first award that I'll be presenting is the Community Award and these students have been awarded this particular award for their outstanding effort and contribution at University of West London in which they were involved in the facilitation of a lecture programme that they had planned and researched themselves. 
They had also invited guest speakers to speak on the day and their event was an overall success. So that being said, congratulations to Dashika Bika, Nasteha Elmi and Balkis Ali. Well done for your fantastic efforts and achievements. The following award is now going to be given um, to these students for their exceptional efforts. They were involved in the marketing and the production of a business product and they worked extremely hard. They showed great excellence, leadership and team working ability. Those students are Gursaf Gotcha, Lovepreet Kaur and Nitesh Kuma. Congratulations to you three and I'm excited to see what other products you have in store. This particular award now is going to be the Head of House Award and it's going to be given to students who have worked incredibly hard with the Head of House team, supporting them in the events that have been run throughout this academic year. Those students are Fard Chowdhury and Karen Deep Singh. Congratulations and thank you very much for your support and the efforts that you have shown in helping with the planning and the delivery of these events. The final award is going to be the Head of Year Award and is in acknowledgement of these students' progress and achievement. These students have worked exceptionally hard from Year 12 right the way through and they have continued to show great progress, great determination and great resilience. Even in spite of our time away from school, they never wavered and they continue to show the same effort that they had shown whilst in school. So those students are Dominic Randua, Davina Mystery, Sukman Prekor and Gursaf Gohotra. Okay, congratulations to you four. You've shown such excellent and, outs and you've outstandingly performed well. And I know that you'll continue to do so. And I know that there are great things in store during your time in year 13. Okay, so without further ado, just want to say congratulations to everyone that has won an award. Um, and I'm con incredibly proud of you all. And I know that there are great things ahead. It gives me great pleasure to announce the following awards for last year's Year 13 pupils. Uh, such a hardworking, resilient, determined year group. Uh, firstly, I'd like to award the three awards for outstanding Key Stage 5 results. And first goes to the amazing Manpreet Singh, who attained four A-star grades in maths, further maths, physics and chemistry. Secondly, to Sheila Nazareth for attaining three A-star grades in politics, geography, and psychology. And thirdly, for Azan Khan, who attained two A-stars and one A-grade in chemistry, economics, and maths. For the BTEC Award for Outstanding Key Stage 5 Results, the first one goes to Kamaljeet Kaur, for her Distinction Star Distinction in Health and Social Care and Distinction in Business. Uh, Komalpreet Bal for attaining the D Star D Health and Social Care and D in Distinction in IT. And last but not least, Abhishek Achaya, who attained Distinction Star Distinction and another distinction. So amazing set of results. Uh, now over to the awards for subjects as nominated by subject teachers. Um, firstly, for art, Just Curran Singh, uh, such an amazing dedication to the subject and high quality work produced throughout, leading to his A star. Secondly, for biology, uh, Zane Butt. Zane is one of the most hardworking characters and individuals that we are, we have come across here at Featherton High School and he goes on to study medicine at St George's so good luck Zane. Uh, next up for business we have Harman Shin for fantastic entrepreneur skills and commitment to the subject. Chemistry we have Azan Khan so again work fantastic dedication hard work resilience and progress made throughout chemistry throughout his two years of study. Uh, computer science, we have Shangithan Thavaraj, again, consistently striving to be, uh, to attain the top grades and to always work to his best ability. For economics, we have the amazing Fadi Majdalawi, who is off to Oxford to study. 
So again, outstanding passion and flair for the subject shown throughout his two years. For English literature, we have Mahida Chima. So again, leading to some fantastic results and really academic skills shown by Mahida throughout her two years of study for English. For further math, none other than Manpreet Singh again himself. A star grade, uh, problem solving skills, absolutely amazing work throughout his two years. For geography, we have Parminda Singh. So outstanding uh, commitment, strife, striving for knowledge and progression throughout his two years of study. So well done, Parminda. Over to politics, we have Sheila Nazaret. Again, fantastic commitment to studies and uh, articulation of topics and understanding shown throughout. For history, we have Hiba Arif, who is off to study law at LSE. So diligence and hardworking student, uh, always meeting targets and surpassing to be the best that she can be, which led to those fantastic results and the offer to LSE. Uh, for maths, we have Asad Ahmed, who has really excelled in his two years. So well done, Asad. Uh, commitment, dedication, knowledge and expertise in the subject. For physics, we have Shangith and Thavaraj. So high levels of attainment thanks to his drive and internal passion for the subject. For psychology, we have Muntaha Hussein, who's off to study social work at Goldsmith University. Fantastic commitment, knowledge, application to the subject throughout her two years. For sociology, we have Rakea Chowdhury. Uh, exceptional progress and commitment to the subject all through the two years of study. Over to the BTEC subjects, we have for health and social care, Julianne Ariola. So again, fantastic work rate, dedication, application and commitment to the subject. For BTEC Sport, we have Anwar Jama, outstanding effort in coursework, particularly in year 13. So exceptionally hard work to achieve a distinction throughout. Well done, Anwar. For business, BTEC Business, we have Abhishek Achaya. So again, hard work commitment shown to the subject throughout. For BTEC Applied Science, we have Fatihan Akhtar. So commitment and sheer effort and pleasant personality shown throughout the two years. And last but not least, for BTEC ICT, we have Komalpreet Bal for inspiration for those around her. Nothing has phased her. She joined us in year 12 as an external student and excelled throughout her two years. So again, it gives me great pleasure to say thank you to all of these individuals and to really commend them on their commitment, work rate and desire shown throughout the two years of Key Stage 5 study. I'd like to finish now by thanking everybody for their contribution to what has been an exceptionally strong year at Featherstone High School, despite the most challenging of circumstances. So thank you to everyone and well done.